Time to kick back, relax, and enjoy a Ken Marchant video. Well, I'm here in Shipping Ongar in England. Unfortunately, this year I'm on my own. Satchko and Leon can't make it. Um, what I'm going to do today is walk along the long distance footpath known as the St. Peter's Way, which um, leads from which goes from Onga all the way to the Chapel of St. Peter of Bradwell on Sea. Um, not sure how far I'm going to be able to walk today, but come along with me and let's see how we go. St. Martin's Church, Chipping Onga. And there's a sign showing us that we're on the St. Peter's Way and also the Essex Way at this point. Pretty windy today. It's been incredibly hot for the last, well, I don't know, I only arrived here um, last week. Um, but it's been incredibly hot. Last night there was a massive downpour and the weather's got a bit cooler so it's pretty nice for walking. And across this bridge over the river roading. The river's looking mighty choked up. The water's very, very low. It's been so hot these past months that there's really not much of the river we can see. Now in the village of Hyonga. Across this ploughed field towards the edge of the wood over there and now along by the edge of the wood now across this beautiful field of golden barley wheat fields this time And another St. Peter's Way marker. I've just arrived in the village of Blackmore. Um, apparently during the time of the Great Plague this village was absolutely devastated and two roads were made to bypass the village so travellers wouldn't come in contact with the uh, victims. This is Blackmore Church. This is the bull pub in uh, Blackmore. Probably about 500 years old, I should think. Now it's under the busy main road, the Red Lion Pub. Cheers. And now under the railway. Wow, it's pretty dark in here. I have to admit, my feet are getting a bit sore right now. Okay, crossing a little bridge over the River Weed.
now through this pleasant wooded area up these stairs along another shady lane and finally the village of Stock where I end today's section of the St Peter's Way long distance footpath. Tim Marjantok.